haven't had a cinnamon bun like this since my grandma Gloria. <laughs> well, it's her recipe. I got them from Carmine in exchange for an injury report and a little filly out in Belmont. Um. Tell them I said hi, okay? I will, thank you. They're actually at Lake George for the whole month, and it's the only time of the year where they don't worry about me. Come on, trust me. I'm a parent and a grandparent. You always worry. Hey, look. Hi. Wait, can I see a menu for some uh, to go, please? The only thing that has to go here is you. Oh, Mike, come on. Look, you don't use my granddaughter against my son nearly get her killed and walk in here and ask for pancakes like it's nothing. No, actually, okay, I I'm just out. wanted a bagel and some coffee. That's it. Out. I just, uh, I, it's a thank you for the amazing boat ride. But if you do want to do me a favor. It depends. Okay, so I'm having a hard time understanding why you hate Sunny so much. I get that he was mean to your sister, I, I get all of that, but is it really worth the grudge that you're carrying? Wow. I think I've heard this somewhere else before. It's hard to remember exactly where it all started. I, if I had to guess, it would be right around the time where Sonny accused me for kidnapping Michael and then shooting Kate. You know, Kate, right? No, but I have heard of Connie. Ah, okay, well, Kate okay. got shot on her wedding day. And Sonny blamed me for the whole thing. He had his goons pick me up. That's putting it nicely. And... They dragged me to this abandoned psychiatric hospital where they held me and beat the crap out of me for days. Tried to force me to <laughs> cop to something that I never even did. So Claudia, in typical Claudia fashion, wanted retribution, took out a hit on Sonny, hired this guy. Long story short, the guy missed. Well, it ricocheted and it hit Michael. Oh. Okay, so that, that's how Michael ended up in the coma. And then after all of this, Sonny went and married Claudia? <laughs> Match made in heaven, right? Man. And Sonny finally found out that Claudia was responsible for the shooting. He went ballistic, caught her out in front of a room full of people. Claudia in turn kidnapped Carly. I'm sure you know the, the events that happened. The rest of the night, it's just a whole snowball. I'm really sorry about your sister. Thank you. She had her issues, though. My father treated her like crap. So in turn, she would always go after the guy who would treat her that way. And Sonny had no problem using Claudia. You know, he'd call her his wife in order to get what he wanted, and that finally just destroyed her. And really, nobody's ever held him accountable for any of it. That's what I'm here for. <laughs> that should be your cue to run for the hills. You can take the last one. Thank you. You're very welcome. Okay, so I'm still having trouble understanding how two people can see someone so differently. Let's take Sonny, right? He's my godfather, and he has always been good. Always been good to me. But then my father couldn't stand him, and my mom, she was very close with them their whole lives. Wow. You know, you sound like that old legion of Sonny fans. It's got a million and one reasons why I'm wrong, and Sonny's deserving of sainthood. Really? Mm -hmm. Now, I wouldn't go that far. Well, but you're saying he's a good guy, right? That he's good to his kids, he gives money to the hospital, he's got a big heart. Doesn't drown puppies. Did I say that? No. Yeah. What I was going to say is that this is your game with Sonny. It's all you. And you can feel however you want to feel, and you can do the things you want to do. But that doesn't mean that I have to agree with you. The truth is, I shouldn't even care. Why do you? I trust you. 
trust my instincts. And I feel like if you're gonna be so passionate and stubborn, then there's gotta be more to it. Oh, then why give me the benefit of the doubt? Oh, okay, so... Are you saying I shouldn't? This is, uh... A really bad idea. Why is that? Is there something wrong, officer? Is it suddenly against the law to have breakfast in the company of a pretty lady? No, I mean, hey, the upside to whatever this is, is I can tell my mother you've moved on, which is great. But for the future, maybe you should consider Brooke Hoffman this. Wow. Since when did that become your call? 